My name is Dr. Roy Fleischman from the University of Texas Southwest Medical Center in Dallas, Texas. On behalf of my co-authors, it is my pleasure to present a brief overview of a study that looked at multiple switches between the biosimilar adalimumab PF064-10293 and reference adalimumab in patients with active rheumatoid arthritis published in the Lancet of Rheumatology. While generic drugs are exact copies of brand-name conventional medicines made through chemical synthesis, Biologic medicines are very complex molecules that are extracted from living organisms. As a result, this structure is very slightly from batch to batch, making exact copies impossible. We therefore describe biosimilar drugs as accrued biologic products that are similar to original biologic medicines. A biosimilar must have the same treatment benefits and safety profile and be given the same way as original biologic, referred to as the reference. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration, or FDA, may designate a biosimilar as interchangeable, meaning it may be substituted for the reference without requiring approval from the prescriber. This additional interchangeability designation is granted in the U.S. only, and substitution of an interchangeable biosimilar for the reference is subject to individual state laws. The FDA recommends that clinical studies be conducted to support a demonstration of interchangeability to assess what the body does to the biosimilar, referred to as pharmacokinetics, or PKP short, which is measured by drug concentration in the blood. In addition, these studies should include data from multiple switches between drugs to demonstrate there is no additional risk or reduced drug effectiveness. If a patient switches back and forth between an interchangeable biosimilar and its reference as compared with receiving treatment with just the reference. PF 0641029 or adalimumab AFCB, is a biosimilar of adalimumab, a TNF inhibitor, approved in the U.S., EU, and other countries. The multi-switched study was conducted to assess the interchangeability of adalimumab AFZB with reference adalimumab. Here on, I will refer to adalimumab AFZB as the biosimilar and reference adalimumab as the reference. A primary objective was to evaluate the effect of multiple switches between the biosimilar and the reference on blood drug concentrations in patients with rheumatoid arthritis were also receiving the, the immunosuppressant drug methotrexate. All patients are on their reference. At week 10, half the patients were randomly assigned to the switching group and half were randomly assigned continuous treatment with the reference for the entire study. The switching group received the biosimilar for six weeks, then switched the reference for six weeks, then switched back to the biosimilar until the end of the trial. PK was assessed between 30 to 32. PK endpoints are the most sensitive indicators of a potential effect of alternative switching between the reference and the biosimilar on efficacy. The primary endpoints to measure adalimumab PK were the maximum concentration of drug, called Cmax, and the total concentration of drug in the body during the whole two-week dosing interval, called AUC-TAU. 213 patients were assigned to the switching group and 214 to the non-switching group. The two patient groups were comparable at the end of the study with more than 90% of patients completing the study. PK equivalence between the switching and continuous treatment groups was established as there was no clinically meaningful differences between them. There were no meaningful difference between the groups in adverse events, or AEEs, including immunogenic re- AEEs during treatment were reflective of known adverse events with adalimumab or related to rheumatoid arthritis. The proportion of patients who discontinued the study due to AEs was similar between groups. The study found that the risk of diminished efficacy or AEs following multiple switches between the reference and the biosimilar is not greater than the risk of using the reference alone. This is the first multi-switch study in patients with rheumatoid arthritis designed to assess interchangeability of a biosimilar adalimumab. To date, the FDA have completed their review and provisionally determined the standards for interchangeable well biosimilar have been met. We therefore conclude that the biosimilar can be expected to produce the same clinical result as reference adalimumab in any given patient with safety and efficacy. Thank you for watching this video abstract. If you'd like to know more about this study, we invite you to read the full article in the Lancet Rheumatology. Finally, on behalf of the authors, I'd like to thank the patients, the medical professionals, from all participating centers who made this study possible.